I, when I smell this, I think about a lumberjack. <laughs> like a sexy lumberjack just dice in the way I would. So what is up you guys? It's your girl Nasia G, also known as Glam Is if you're new here, welcome to the family, y'all. If you're new here, then welcome, welcome, welcome. If you already subscribed and you know how this go, today I'm coming to you with a perfume guide for Valentine's Day or Valentine's Day perfume guide, however you want to word it. This is simply going to be five different scents, maybe six different scents that I personally would wear for Valentine's Day, whether you have a Galentine's, a Mr. or Mrs., whatever it is, as long as you want to smell good, this video is for you. So if you want to see what I'm rocking this Valentine's Day, just keep watching. So I'm going in no particular order, but just to start this off and get Miss Girl out the way. The first one I'm mentioning is Miss Baccarat Rouge 540. Everyone in the world knows about this scent at this point. It is my classic scent for this video. It is very, I think it's very, very sexy and sweet. Um, this is technically a unit sex fragrance but if I smell this on a guy I don't think I would like it too much so again this is just my classic go-to for Valentine's Day if you want your date your man your boo your bae whatever to be like oh baby come here come here come here a little closer Miss Baccarat Rouge is going to be your go-to for a easy simple classic Valentine my next girl for this video is not one that I've seen on the YouTube tip just yet and y'all oh, Tom Ford who my next girl is Miss Banana Republic dark cherry and amber and get into the bottle the bottle alone screams sexy like look at this it is sleek uh oh won't focus it is sleek it is red it has this pretty 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 dark scent to it I mean dark tone to it and y'all it's like if cherries and firewood in a in a sexy man like a man when i smell this i think about a lumberjack <laughs> like a sexy lumberjack just dice in the way y'all she is that girl now i wanted me a cherry scent but i didn't want to go lost cherry route and a lot of the other cherry scents i smelled smelled like robotussin to me so when i smelled this one i said i gotta have it this right here and it lingers oh my god now this could be unisex. I do not know much about Banana Republic scents. I'm not even sure if this is a unisex scent, but like I said, when I smelled it, I had to buy it, purchased it. I don't even know if you can get it um, from like the Banana Republic website anymore, but I got mine off like Overstock for like $23. So again, if you want a cherry scent, but you're not trying to break the bank with Tom Ford Lost Cherry, this is your girl right here. Next we have this girl right here. And if you watched my 2021 favorites, I'm gonna need you to pause this video and screenshot this one too. Hold on. Screenshot it. You got it? This is a Whooped Almond by Mix Bar. It is one of their newest launches in y'all. She got it. I would describe this scent as sophisticated but also really really playful like i could wear this to work i could wear this to bed i've been wearing it to both but you get that almond scent and honestly i'm gonna look at the notes i'll have them on the screen as well but i think you get a little bit of a cherry scent too it is definitely you definitely get that almond but you definitely get the sweet like i said you definitely get the sophisticated if you know you have a lunch date or a morning date i don't know valentine's day is on a monday i don't know how you and your man gonna work it out and y'all, maybe I'm going to go to brunch Sunday morning, then watch the Super Bowl. I don't know. But this is definitely a scent that you could get away with for Valentine's Day. And again, it is definitely one that it won't break the bank and will turn heads. My next girl is no stranger to YouTube at freaking all. The last two weren't. So if you see anybody else talking about it, tell them Nate G put them on first. But this one, she's made her way around the internet. This is ysl libre or leave or libra i don't care if you pronounce it i say libre intense and it is in this pretty ysl bottle oh and the color of cognac and she gives me just that this is definitely a grown woman scent this is the scent you wear if your man tell you to get your sexy on a valentine's day like not cute he said maybe sexy so that means you're putting on the the fitted red dress 
or the fitted black dress or whatever color you're going, it's fitted though, okay? When you wear this, she's fitted. Hair is to the nines. Makeup is beat. Shoe is high. Hurting, but you smell good. And you whip your hair, you go, mm. And he like, dang, you smell good. Like, I know, I know. This is her. She gives me elegance. She gives me class. She gives me fur coat because it's cold outside. That's this girl right here. I've been rocking this since last year and she will go down as one of my favorites always. Every time I wear this, I get compliments from guys and I'm not gonna stop. I'm simply just not gonna stop. So again, Miss YSL Libre Intense. If you don't have her, go get her. Go get her. My next girl in the chat is another one who's made her way around YouTube, made her way all around the internet. Auntie Jackie had us going crazy thinking she was getting miscontinued. And she's not. It's Miss Princess by Killian. The bottle alone speaks for itself. The scent alone speaks for itself. I love this scent. Now, although it is very popular, I think that everyone could have it in their collection. Princess by Killian is definitely the more sweeter scent for Valentine's Day. She's very, very sweet. She has that marshmallow scent. She's very girly, still very intoxicating. Uh, this will make your man want to eat you up. It's the one. <laughs> edible you trying to smell edible with sexy edible cute this one right here you want him to eat you up at the end of the night slurp slurp you like a lemon drop this is your girl this is your girl right? girl girl if you can't afford the big body go get you the go get you the little travel size set because she, a little goes a long way with miss princess she is the epitome of sweet like when i smell it i'm just like candy cotton candy Cotton candy, marshmallows, toasted, that's her. Okay, again, if you're trying to get ate up, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, go ahead and get you some of that. My last scent to join the Valentine's Day train is this girl right here. I haven't talked to her, talked about her on my channel before, but baby, this is Miss Valentino Voice Viva Intense. I hope I'm saying that right. Please don't come from me in the comments, baby. Um, but I smelled the original and the original was too floral for me. So this one right here. This is another grown one. She's grown. She has a 401k. She has a fur coat. She may drive a Jaguar. She's grown, okay? But she is so sexy. I wore this and I was shopping and this man stopped me. He said, that's you smelling like that? I said, well, what you smell? He said, it smell good. I said, oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> that's me, okay. This one right here, again, the bottle, the color of the, the perfume just hints at it being very, very sexy. Like I, I think anything with like a darker tone just screams sex to me. Like, yeah, I smell sexy. I don't smell too cute. I smell sexy. So this is another one. When you get in the car with your date, or when he opened that door and you walk past him, he am like, oh shoot, what's that? He don't want to get a little closer, get up on your neck, on your ear. Yeah, this is her. This is her again. If you cannot afford the baby auto, I would definitely invest in the travel size for about 30 bucks. And again, if you want to go even inexpensive for a full bottle, there's always mixed bar. I try to always make sure I give you guys high end and affordable scents because everybody can need to smell good, boo. Everybody. Okay, my loves, I know that was quick and to the point, and that is the point. I want everyone to be able to, A, see this video, give it a thumbs up, but also take notes. I didn't want it to be drawn out. I didn't want to give you every single scent. I just kind of gave, gave you a scenario, maybe an outfit detail or two um, of what the, each scent would give, and I hope this helped. If you pick up any of these or have any of these in your collection that you plan on rocking for Valentine's Day, please comment. Please let me know. Please hit me up on Instagram. Uh, you know, if your man like it, you know, be like, you know, let me know. Because I'll I be here. I'll be wanting to hear the feedback from the men. Like, okay, like the men like that one. Because I'm trying to put the girls on. I love you guys so, so, so freaking much. Thank you for all the love and always consistently being there. I hope you have a great Valentine's, Valentine's, Lover's Day, Me Day, whatever you having. Just make sure you're smelling good. Okay? I tried to help. I love you guys so much. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Mwah.